Now it's time for Simon Löffler of KiwiGrid from Dresden in the yeah. south of Germany, yeah. uh, of Berlin, of Berlin. Of, of Berlin, yes. In the east yeah. of Germany. <laughs> it, okay. it, yes, it is in the east of Germany. Unfortunately, I live in Bonn, but uh, the company is in Dresden and um, I'm the chief sales executive of uh, KiwiGrid. And Jens, uh, you need to listen very closely to this presentation because he said real smart companies have software and hardware. And I believe in the same, and this is why I think it's good to work for KiwiGrid, and let's have a look what we do. Um, our vision is we make distributed energy accessible, always, everywhere, for everybody. We have talked a lot about platforms today. Um, we'll see what, what we have to offer. First, a little insight into the company. Um, we are located in Dresden, as said. Um, we have about 72 employees, planning a couple more to have a couple more at the end of the year. Um, we're in the uh, um, energy data management sector. Um, we have products. One of them is our energy cloud. The other one is a hardware device. It's the energy manager. Um, we have on top of the cloud the energy market where you can share your energy apps. And um, for the German market especially, we have a smart meter gateway, which is uh, a regulatory smart meter gateway if you want um, for uh, customers over 6,000 kilowatt hours of energy consumption a year. Um, we are a startup. Um, actually, Christopher just put us with, with, with our logo in all those big logos, so actually we're brand name now, um, and not a startup anymore. Um, we have, of course, investors, which we are very um, grateful for. Uh, Alexander Frankenberg said today, energy data management is uh, the thing um, which works best for, uh, uh, for Heike Grunderfor. Heike Grunderfor is one of our investors. Thank you for the money. Um, the KiwiGrid platform, what is the solution really offering? I said we have uh, hardware and we have uh, the, the, the cloud. Um, so the first thing we have to do is to do the connectivity in the field. I think this is also a task nobody likes to do because it's very technical and, 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 and service-wise it's a very hard thing to do. We started um, on, on that level. Um, I didn't do a lot of marketing, not, not a lot of uh, talking in conferences, but worked really hard on that level. Well, how, how did we do it? Um, we looked for strong and, and partner, opened um, uh, a possibility for them to, to go together with us and to implement all protocols, uh, uh, communication ways in order to do that. So now we have a really, really strong base already of connectivity. Um, and we do that with our um, hardware devices, um, which is kind of our first product, um, which is something we need to get into the field now. Um, way bigger than, than, than now, but we already have uh, five-digit numbers out there. But we want to scale this business because, of course, this business of hardware then scales our energy cloud at the end um, to be the operating system of the energy vendor in Germany or in the US, wherever uh, this will lead us. This is our hardware. Um, there is one German word which I cannot translate. It's the Eierlegen, the Wolfmilchsau. Um, so it talks all protocols down to the, in, in the field, and it, you can do whatever you want uh, to get it up. I'm only the, uh, a commercial guy, so don't ask me about the technical things, but it works um, a thousand times in the field. Um, then, of course, we have a front end for the customer, um, something uh, people then actually see. What you see here, I show you other pictures later, um, is actually something you would never see. Uh, because we are totally white labeled at the moment. So um, this is always the look and feel of our customers. And behind this front end, of course, we have the Energy Cloud, um, a very huge platform um, and a very capable platform. The advantages of our platform, and actually we shouldn't stress the word platform anymore. I try to now use the word operational system. So scream if I say platform again, and I, I, I promise to delete this in all of my slides for the future. Um, what is it? It's neutral, very important for us, uh, we think, um, that we as a company uh, offer a neutral platform and try to be neutral. What did I do? Did I say platform? Sorry, see? It's, it's in there. But good that you screamed, huh? <laughs> so everybody woke up, everybody woke up, they're all asleep, Simon, boring. Um, so, <clears throat> so it's neutral, it's open to others, so it's, uh, the, the cloud is based on, on, on Java. The, uh, the energy manager is based on Android systems. So we're open for other, for partners, for startups, for whoever wants to come and, 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 and do something together with us. It's a total open platform. It's highly safe. 
But you see, it is really hard, right? <laughs> operational system, operational system. Um, so it's very safe, um, very important, I think. Uh, we're talking about infrastructure. Um, it's flexible. You can widen and widen it. A lot of uh, use cases I, I'm, I'm trying to go on a show, but I have not a lot of time. It's bi-directional bi and sustainable. I have to go because the time is running out. So there are also clients using this, some top references. Um, here, so you see all the, also the variety of, of partners we have so far. It's telecommunication business, it's utility, it's electronics, um, it's uh, solar uh, equipment manufacturers, uh, um, all of them. And uh, of course, automotive, uh, electric mobility is a big thing. So to look into a couple of use cases, just really short because time is running out, and then you see how the, how the front end actually looks like for the customer. This is something we have done for Solar World. This is a, a storage uh, PV optimization system. This is the front end to the customer. You also have a front end for the, um, for the installer who installed, so he can do uh, look after and do maintenance and whatsoever, and quality management, um, Solar World itself has also its own channel um, towards uh, a system like this. Other thing, totally different business, uh, energy supply, Pulsewerke, we're running the virtual power plant, the Pulsewerke on top of our cloud. And this is, uh, this is the thing. Um, other thing, uh, BMW, car manufacturer, we did the showcase in Las Vegas uh, in, in, in January. Um, this is um, a solar car. Uh, how do you call them? Car carport, yes, oh, it's an English word. So the carport, and, um, and now we, we did all the algorithms to, to really load the car from the, so the solar port and um, put in a nice uh, uh, tariff on top of it, and this is what we did for BMW. Um, or uh, something for tenants, uh, apartment buildings, big uh, scale rooftop uh, PVs, and then um, and then you have tenants uh, get, getting the energy from, and you need to, 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 to build this and, and look for this. Um, it's called in German Mieterstrommodell, um, and Lichtblick is doing that in, in, in Hamburg. I think it's actually a Berlin project um, where, where, they, where they do that at the moment, and we have done that um, for Lichtblick. So our partner network on top of our cloud is growing and growing. There are platform partners who are actually running apps um, we have development partners who help us to be the best in technology, and we have device partners where we can uh, try to get more connectivity, and in, at the end, we all want to be not the platform, but the operational system of energy. Thank you. Thank you, you know, the Eier legen eine Wollmilchsau, um, it's actually four animals in one. It's a pig, <laughs> it's a pig. It's a chicken that makes eggs, it's a sheep that makes wool, and a cow that makes milk. M milk, yeah. yeah. So now you have learned yeah. something. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. We have a question. Hello, Kees Modder, uh, very dumb. I, I've got a question to you. Uh, it's a kind of a question about paradoxes. And sometimes you have to live the paradoxes and remain sane. So it's a little bit about it's open. The operating system is open, but also my question is where as a startup do you focus on or where as a startup do you not focus on? Okay, at the moment um, we clearly focus on, uh, uh, the, the long term focus of course is the cloud and the operation of the cloud uh, for all the customers who want to use it uh, as their operational system. Um, at the moment we are very much focusing on projects as we want to generate revenue, and sometimes we focus too much on projects and have less developer for, our pla for the operational system of energy. I'm getting better. And, um, and of course, we're focusing on hardware at the moment because we need to get the hardware scalable out there in, in order to get a bigger operational system of energy. <laughs> Great. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Simon. <laughs> <laughs>